ಸೈಜಿ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ವಾಹಿನಿಯ ಎಲ್ಲ ವೀಕ್ಷಕರಿಗೆ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಹಾಗೂ ಶುಭ ಸಂಜೆ ಮಾರ್ಗದರ್ಶಿ ದ ಎಜು ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟೂ ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮಕ್ಕೆ ತಮಗೆ ಎಲ್ರಿಗೂ ಸ್ವಾಗತಿಸ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೇನೆ ಇದು ಇವತ್ತಿನ ನಮ್ಮದು ಹತ್ತನೇ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಿರ್ಬೋದು ನಾವು ಕಳೆದ ಮಾರ್ಚಲ್ಲಿ ತ್ರಿಷಾ ಕ್ಲಾಸಸ್ ಉಡುಪಿ ಹಾಗೂ ಡೈಜಿ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಸಹಭಾಗಿತ್ವದಲ್ಲಿ ಈ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಗೈಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಥವಾ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಪ್ಲಾನಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಮಾರ್ಗದರ್ಶಿ ಅನ್ನೋ ಹೆಸರಲ್ಲಿ ನಾವು ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮವನ್ನು ಶುರು ಮಾಡಿದ್ವಿ ಬೇಸಿಕಲಿ ದ್ವಿತೀಯ ಪಿ ಯು ಸಿಯ ವಿದ್ಯಾರ್ಥಿಗಳನ್ನು ಫೋಕಸ್ ಆಗಿಟ್ಕೊಂಡು ಅವರಿಗೆ ಮುಂದಿನ ದಿನಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವ ರೀತಿಯ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ಸ್ಗಳನ್ನು ಚೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ಬೋದು ಆ ನಿಟ್ಟಿನಲ್ಲಿ ಮಾಹಿತಿಗಳನ್ನು ಒಂದು ತರುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ಸಣ್ಣ ಎಫರ್ಟ್ ನಮ್ಮ ಕಡೆಯಿಂದ ಆಗಿತ್ತು ಈಗಾಗಲೇ ನಾವು ಒಂಬತ್ತು ಎಪಿಸೋಡನ್ನು ಮುಗಿಸಿ ಇವತ್ತು ಹತ್ತನೇ ಎಪಿಸೋಡಿಗೆ ಕಾಲಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ದೇವೆ ಅದೇ ರೀತಿ ನಮಗೆ ಸಾಕಷ್ಟು ಫೀಡ್ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಗಳು ಕರೆಗಳು ನಮ್ಮ ಪೇರೆಂಟ್ಸಿಂದ ಹಾಗೂ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸಿಂದ ಬಂದಿದೆ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕೀಪ್ಸ್ ಅಸ್ ಮೋಟಿವೇಟಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಗೋ ಅಹೆಡ್ ಅಂತ ನಾನು ಹೇಳಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಇಷ್ಟಪಡ್ತೇನೆ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಡಿಸ್ಕಷನ್ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಟಾಕ್ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಐ ಪರ್ಸ್ನಲಿ ಬಿಲೀವ್ ದಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಟರ್ ವೇರ್ ಪ್ರಾಬಬ್ಲಿ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಹೈಲಿ ಅನ್ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೋರ್ಡ್ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ದಿ ಚೂಸಿಂಗ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಕರಿಯರ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಸೊ ಹಾಗಾಗಿ ಐ ಥಾಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ವುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎ ರೈಟ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಟುಡೆ ಫಾರ್ ಎಸ್ಪೆಷಲಿ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಕಾಮರ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಆರ್ ವಾಚಿಂಗ್ ಅಸ್ ಸೊ ಹಾಗಾಗಿ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಈ ಒಂದು ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮದಲ್ಲಿ ನಾನು ಒಂದು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪರ್ಟನ್ನು ಕರೆಸಿದ್ದೇನೆ ಇಸ್ ಅ ರಿಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಮ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೋರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ಅ ವಾಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಶ್ರೀ ದೀಪಕ್ ರಾವ್ ದ ಫೌಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲೆಸ್ಟ್ ಲರ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಅಕಾಡೆಮಿ ಆನ್ ಬಿಹಾಫ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಮೈ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವ್ಯೂವರ್ಸ್ ಐ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ಅ ವಾಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಯೂ ಸರ್ ಸೊ ಇವತ್ತು ಸ್ಟಾಕ್ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅನ್ನುವಂಥದ್ದು ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಬಿಗ್ ಓಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಬಿಲೀವ್ ದಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅನ್ ಓಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಪಾರ್ಚುನಿಟೀಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ಐ ಗೆಟ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಾಕ್ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಸರ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಫೈನಾನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಸಿಸ್ಟಮ್ ಸೊ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಫೈನಾನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಸಿಸ್ಟಮ್ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಒಂದು ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಓವರ್ ವ್ಯೂ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಲೇಮೆನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಆರ್ ವಾಚಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ first of all i would like to uh, thank and appreciate trisha college uh, principal uh, faculty member namchandra uh, patil for such an excellent initiative so i have seen uh, i am i am in the stock market almost capital market for the last two decades right great i have seen the colleges focusing more on education education and education basically books right so i don't say it is wrong but it is very basic you know step level mm-hmm. so what we need to do is that we need to go out of these books and uh, add this kind of value added uh, addition extra curricular activity so it will make them more employable right so that they can experience the the outside world correct and understand the realities and uh, become successful and perform in the practical their, exposure tumba mukhya hai that's most important right so indian financial uh, system and in, in very basic way if you want me to explain mm-hmm. it is nothing but a mechanism which connects savings and investments okay in a simple way let's take okay like and the common students so they know that they have gone through you know tons of theory in the books right so what i say is that i always keep it simple so this is a mechanism which connects investors with the uh, people who have got a savings right so this is a indian financial system okay so indian financial system there are various segments mm-hmm. so where capital market is one of the most important uh, segment which enable uh, people or uh, especially corporate people to raise long term capital in the form of equity okay so other in the stock market is uh, the secondary market in the in the capital market where initially if any company or corporates want to raise uh, funds mm-hmm. they will do it through initial public offer you know that IP. you know so right. that ipo on delta so once you invest it through ipo mm-hmm. so if a if a investor want to sell that mm-hmm. share so he has to go to the secondary market which is nothing but a stock exchange okay so illinda we can go ahead with the stock market right so stock market is a part of the indian financial system ante helutare so idu sakashtu janarige ivattu gottide but adralli ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಡೀಪರ್ ಯಾರಿಗೂ ಗೊತ್ತಿರಲ್ಲ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳ್ತದೆ ಮೇಲ್ನೋಟಕ್ಕೆ ಎಲ್ರಿಗೂ ಸ್ಟಾಕ್ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನು ಎಷ್ಟು ಶೇರ್ಸ್ಗಳು ಇವತ್ತು ಫ್ಲೋಟ್ ಆಗ್ತಿದೆ ಬಿ
very nice so that's a that's a huge money Hello. for a, for a fresher who has gone from mangalore uh, very true mba so even till today i keep in touch with mumbai once in a three months i visit mumbai because you, you have to feel that uh, you know vibration of a mumbai stock market now what is so special about uh, mumbai which is not uh, probably absent in other of the cities like mangalore udupi okay enan bodhi impression so, first of all i have not seen uh, youngsters from our place uh, mm-hmm. in the capital market or in the financial uh, service Alva? field that's right adu adrinda so we have to encourage you know them to them to be a part of the capital market absolutely so adrinda so today session i am going to you know educate them or give throw some more light on the Correct. stock market you want to ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರಿ ಅವರ್ ಯೂತ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಾಬಬ್ಲಿ ದ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ಪಾರ್ಟಿಸಿಪೇಷನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ವೈಟ್ ಲೆಸ್ ಸೊ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಆಪ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಔಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಹು ಪ್ರಾಬಬ್ಲಿ ವುಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೋರ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಡೊಮೈನ್ ಸೊ ಹೇಳಿ ಸರ್ ಇದರ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಈ ಸೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಎಂಪ್ಲಾಯ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಪರ್ಚುನಿಟೀಸ್ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಏನು ಹೇಳಕ್ಕೆ ಇಷ್ಟಪಡ್ತೀನಿ ಎಂಪ್ಲಾಯ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಪರ್ಚುನಿಟೀಸ್ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಹೇಳುವ ಮೊದಲು uh-huh stock market is a gambling market. so this Sorry. is the one biggest uh, myth you have to How? break it. absolutely stock market or equity investment is a <laughs> genuine long term equity in, uh, investment avenue right second way so i am i am really shocked ya ke mindset bannide ya ke mindset hogta illa sir any idea on that okay. basically enu antu helide this is because of the kind of advice given by by the so called huh. other uh, people in the industry itself oh so what is the see basically humans are uh, human wants are unlimited <laughs> so we have unlimited wants and we our resource to satisfy those wants are limited right so the next question that comes into a normal human financial behavior is that mm-hmm. how do i satisfy those unlimited wants with the limited income absolutely well so said. the next option is that so where i can multiply my money over a night <laughs> so stock market is one of the such a hot uh, hot oven where people think they can multiply their money in the short term and ultimately they lose if they speculate right that so that's the not the reality is what you say exactly so, so first, first point in the day students has to understand that equity or stock market we can consider it as a legitimate uh, 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 long term investment avenue okay. absolutely so other than so that is the first important point mm-hmm. second important point is that let's say how the stock market is performing in india for the last 43 years mm-hmm. because the sensex almost started the base year in 1979 with 100 points right so if you look at the today's sensex so it is about 54000 level absolutely so if you put these two figures mm-hmm. 43 years back 1979 100, 100. and today 54000 and if you need excel sheet alone simple formula mm-hmm. xirr hakidre uh-huh. it will show you a return of about 17% per annum growth okay so which is excellent so what i'm trying to tell you is that right. the average return of the sensex mm-hmm. bombay stock exchange sensitive index mm-hmm. is 17% per annum Nodi. for the last 42 years which is average absolutely so i don't think so any investment next to real estate has given this kind of return in the absolutely. long term absolutely true i don't also i don't uh, understand people are talking about risk mm-hmm. so you have to deal with the risk mm-hmm. risk is in two forms mm-hmm. risk alone and tell you risk which can be managed risk which cannot be managed, be managed. right new stock market and if you consider as a stock market as a speculation mm-hmm. then you cannot manage the risk absolutely it, it is very clear agree with you but if you understand if you consider stock market as a long term investment avenue risk can be managed and we can earn optimum return Now, what is that optimum return? Optimum return is no risk to capital. Without taking any risk to capital, can we earn at least 50% more than the bank FD interest? Right. That's all. And we are, and stock market has shown it. That's right. Because bank FD sl- uh, rates have slashed down actually. Yes. So, we can expect right. in the current scenario, we can expect anything between 9 to 12% per annum. But uh, this materialistic fact is not in the society. Mutilla. So, it is because of lack of financial... <laughs> Literacy. literacy as well as financial responsibility Correct. so it's most important so someone has to take uh, go one step ahead so we at simplest always you know tell people invest your time before investing your money 
Well said. You must understand how your money is invested, what it is doing. I don't want you to get deep into it, but mm -hmm. the very basic things. Alva. So you say uh, education institution can play this role in very bringing uh, or improving this very financial much. literacy. Very much, very Alva. much. There are a lot of initiatives taking uh, happening uh, towards financial literacy, mm -hmm. uh, but you know, human financial behavior is not that easy to crack and open up. Absolutely. It's, uh, uh, for the last 20 years, you know, it's a very close-minded. Okay. But at simplest, we, our complete effort is to educate, enlighten, and empower. That is our mantra of simplest. Sir, you made an excellent point. You gave a comparison about uh, the stock market decades back and the current uh, trend, which you almost said up to 17% average. Which probably I also asked you that this uh, materialistic fact is not society. And uh, is that the reason, financial literacy beginning now, Mata Didvi, is that the reason why many of them are not into the stock market? Yes, to the population, yes, to percentage of the active agi sir, stock market. This is a very, very important point uh, to be understood. Mm -hmm. So, Nan Heli, 1979 till today, the stock market, the Sensex has generated a return of about 17 percent average compounding return per annum, which is excellent. Right. Without taking any risk to Undoubted. capital. Correct. So, that is the first point. Second point. How many people percentage of the people are in this segment is hardly 1 percent. Like 99 percent people, uh, people who are into stock market are into doing exactly opposite of quality investment which is nothing but a speculation or trading okay. and then they lose the money. Right. So, that is the second uh, thing and one more dangerous fact is that if you as of now, if you try to understand what percentage of the pop Indian population is investing in the Indian stock market is less than 2 percentage. That's it. That's all. Oh. So, that means stock market has done excellently well in the last 43 years, mm -hmm. but Indian investors they are not ready to take risk to their capital. That is why their mindset is they have kept their money into the bank FDs, which alone is 140 lakhs crores as of now. Oh. So, so, that is why the the so called foreign institutional investors mm -hmm. they invest money into indian stock market right. they play whenever amazing. they invest into market they will take the market up and then they leave at a certain level again who is going to lose money it is the indian common Hello. investors right. or the bottom of the pyramid mm -hmm. we are losing our wealth they are taking our wealth every time yeah, how is the scenario in the rest of the world sir very kade financial literacy chanagi jaasti ide nimge america usa you are talking about 60% mm -hmm. Wow, we are nowhere here. So, that is what I am trying to tell you. Mm -hmm. So, 140 lakh crores bank FD that is the one traditional investment. So, which is comes under guaranteed investments and contractual investments. Right. Equity, real estate, currency, commodities these are all part of the performance based investments. Mm -hmm. But now my point is simple new 5 years bank FD theory. So, instead of that if you can take out a small amount of that money and invest here. Yes. Now, I am going to ahead, going to that extent and tell you, do not even take out that money from your bank FD. Mm -hmm. Let Let us not take risk to capital. Mm -hmm. Let us continue with your money in bank FD only. Mm -hmm. But whatever the interest it is earning, can you take Al small portion and invest in equity long term, only now you experience it. You can invest as small as 100 to 500 rupees per month Great. today. That is the beauty of the Indian stock market where we can invest th that small amount and we can experience, we can participate in the economy of the Alva. country. With this trend going currently, how do you expect this trend to change in the next 5 years? If the trend change out then until the problem is that… Or are you, you optimistic know, that this may get improved? No doubt, mm -hmm. but the problem is until the so we humans suffer more from imagination than from reality. <laughs> so, this is the human financial behavior. Right. So, we expect something is going to happen in future. Let us right. say now when the stock market Sensex was around 62,000 levels, uh -huh. the experts in the market they are talking about it is reaching 1 lakh or 2 lakh Sensex. Right. So, this is looks very bottom. Correct. So, people dump money at one shot, right. but what is the reality? It came down. Today market is 20 percent down, Correct. then people blame the market. Right. So, they are doing exactly what they are supposed to do, reverse. You can the small uh, example. When we go to buy vegetables, if somebody says let us say now 40 rupees uh, half a kg butter, potato, so what we try to do? Do we pay 40 rupees and buy straight away or we try to bargain? We try to bargain. Why we try to bargain? To minimize the cost. Right. So, but in stock market, this is one very strange human financial behavior. Mm -hmm. 
ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಕ್ರಾಶ್ ಆದಾಗ ಯಾರು ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡೋದಿಲ್ಲ ಎವ್ರಿಬಡಿ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಸ್ಟ್ಲಿ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಪೀಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ದ ರಿವರ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಸೆಟ್ ಸೊ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಬೈ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಎಟ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಯು ಸೆಲ್ ಎಟ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಲಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪ್ನಿಂಗ್ ನೌ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಪೀಟೆಡ್ಲಿ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಬೆಂಜಮಿನ್ ಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಸೆಟ್ ವಾಲ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಟ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಟೈಮ್ ವಿ ಲೂಸ್ ಮನಿ ವಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ದ ಲೆಸನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ವಿ ಲೂಸ್ ಮನಿ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಪ್ರೊಸೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೂಸಿಂಗ್ ಮನಿ so i think uh, I, i really found this particular event today is much more apt for the commerce students who are watching this yes very much because can this trend be changed by our students who can join this uh, sector and probably bring in more financial literacy in the country very much see basically we have a simpler selling academy uh, academy and uh-huh. so where we try to take youngsters uh-huh. in simpler uh, learning academy okay. and they can we have a short term online courses okay which are very very uh, what is that see we don't deal with the in, uh, information and knowledge okay. which is absolutely available in the college books absolutely. internet everywhere. everywhere what we deal with is that we deal with the insights and wisdom where Fantastic. you where you it is very difficult to get those insights and wisdom mm-hmm. because we teach our online courses from the world's best investors investment thinkers and investment writers like warren buffett benjamin right. graham mm-hmm. john c bogle mm-hmm. so john templeton Right. so from these they are all the best investors in the world alwa great uh, so exactly you highlighted the question that i wanted to ask you yes so ivattu namma commerce vidyarthigalu maybe second pc vidyarthigalu idare degree vidyarthigalu ivattu nodta idare if they want to get into this now i'm sure they are much impressed and uh, kind of inspired by your uh, statements what you made in the last couple of minutes avaru yav riti ee time inda prepare agbodu sir education part alli so that they can get into this domain tomorrow okay so when it comes to employment you can enter the capital market in two ways uh-huh one do new employment employment tagolbodu job madbodu okay which is almost 80% of the population goes they go into mm-hmm. employment or a job okay but rest of the 20% people they uh, want to do something on their own mm-hmm. either you can call it as a employment self employment mm-hmm. at a individual level mm-hmm. if you want to do it at a bigger level you can call it as a business or entrepreneurship right no uh, i asked you basically before getting into that uh, uh, job or a self employment yav riti avaru qualifications anna tagolbeku mattu you will agree with me not many of this commerce uh, subjects highlights the uh, stock market or super deeper hogudilla adralli gotaitu so hagagi avaru yav riti course galanna tagolbodu so that they can strengthen their employment chances in this my strongest advice or recommendation to all commerce students mm-hmm. second pc uh, level aadkole there is something called there are uh, two certification at least there are uh, three things okay one do national stock exchange in our ncfm anthe illond certification to correct national stock exchange certification in financial markets anthe illi right so adralli nimdu beginners module ide intermediate module ide matte advanced module ide so ella level ige bekagage yes right. there are three categories so what i recommend nan yen what i suggest uh, youngsters is that the moment you start your first year of degree so uh, register yourself for the basic modules idakke entry requirement enar idya degree agirbeku hage enilla nothing of that sort anyone can register yes fantastic so adrinda nimge second pc level second pc they may expect it at least the second pc okay yakan idha la basic english alli irthade okay so adrinda so first year become second year become third year become alli eshtu nimge ncfm certification complete maadi kolli gaagutade ashtu modules annu complete maadi kolli okay yakandre if let's say now i am giving a very very real example mm-hmm. if any of your student comes to me for a job mm-hmm. i don't look at their marks okay for me they are bcom or uh, second puc right percentage first first class second class okay that is fine matte allin naan jaasti nodli kogudla what is more important for us is what is your knowledge about the subject matter absolutely new basics of mutual fund pass madidira athwa mm-hmm. derivatives bere uh, modules pass madidira mm-hmm. then your knowledge or understanding about the product or what we deal with is much higher right so adrinda we are looking for that ncfm certification one the nsc mm-hmm. in one the very uh, best uh, and same level is better than is nism huh. national institute of securities market anthili by sebi it is an education institute of sebi itself exactly right so our the sa various modules ide okay our the in the one month in the two years or a full time courses ide okay adannu you based on your interest you can start with the same basic intermediate and uh, advanced level alli okay. starting with the basic level mm-hmm. 
that will give a excellent understanding and so, and uh, their uh, textbooks whatever the material they supply is of excellent quality okay they will they will explain in a very simple way mm -hmm. if you need coaching you can take the coaching also Otherwise but it self is study self study mode okay. but the cost is you know anything between 1500 to 2500 rupees oh, for the majority of the courses oh that's very that's reasonable all, very reasonable okay and straight away certified by people like nsc or nis straight away certification plus job all right straight away Fantastic. If you are NISM certified, let's say now I am in a mutual fund uh, mm -hmm. uh, business. So if somebody comes to me with the NISM certification with the mutual fund module, mm -hmm. yes, you are in. Oh, that that state. Okay. Job and employment. These information, I think, I'm even I'm very sure my students also lacked in this. Yes. Alva, I think it's high time that uh, institutions should offer these courses. In Other no, what I say to commerce and management colleges that make this as a compulsory part of the Alba. part of the syllabus. Bar, compulsory make bar bar it compulsory. Bar. I can say you are straight uh, employability, Alba. especially for finance specializers. Mm -hmm. In the marketing HR, if they are not interested, fine. Okay. But especially for finance specialization, bake bake. make it compulsory. Fantastic. I can say today, if you look at the majority of the employment is happening in the banking, financial services, and insurance industry. Absolutely. Great. So, you have very nicely highlighted about uh, the qualifications part of it. You said we can take up some NCFM courses of NSC at the beginners and advanced level. Other uh, NISM certifications program and uh, there is a high opportunities for you in terms of job. After all this, now what type of employment uh, they get in the stock market? Field? Okay. Nimge, stock market ali, based on your interest and passion, there are different levels. Okay. So, uh, so these are all NASM and NCFM, what I said is a, at a Indian level, but some students are interested in at an international level. Okay. So, there is something called CFP, Certified Financial Planner. CFP. Yeah, which is international degree. Okay. So, again, uh, this may cost you 40, 50,000 rupees, okay. entire thing mm -hmm. at a different module wise. Okay. If you can do study on your own, you can do it. But mm -hmm. it case all panana hello thare coaching be kaag bodo, be kaag bodo. So if you are a CFP, you you can you know you are at a different level. Okay. Because on an average about hundred countries accept this uh, certification. Okay. Fantastic. You can get a job in any part of the countries. Yen kavara gat sir CFP le. CFP le nim ke e module uh, module wise kavara gat nim the financial planning entire concept ano auru made it in a certificate. Mm -hmm. Uh, they will cover uh, all kinds of risk covers. Nimdu emergency funding irbo, the family emergency fund andil okay. They will cover retirement planning. Mm -hmm. They cover uh, children education planning, marriage planning, mm -hmm. your uh, repayment of debts, mm -hmm. all other kind of uh, general objectives, including taxation. Okay. So each module nimge on the either module irto de. Okay. Adhanu niyo pass mod beko, then you become a certified CFP. Degree students are going to be able to do it. Degree students are going to be able to do it. Second PC is going to be able to do it. But this is slightly better at an advanced level. So I would always recommend you to start with the basics of NCFM and NISM. All in the next level. If you want to go to next level, if you want to go to next level, after CFE, there is a next level called Chartered Financial Analysis, CFE. Okay, CFE. CFE. So this is also an international degree which is still Advanced than the CFP because I think we should recommend this to the students. Second, today is the era of globalization, no doubt. Alva. Plus, stu at a student level, their mind is fresh and they have energy, Alva. enthusiasm to learn, and their brain is also fresh to understand and it's absorb nonsense. all these kind of things. True, so, so I think we do have a lot of uh, investment uh, banking from other countries in our India today. We yes, can be a good time recruiters very much. So, any management commerce college for that matter, uh -huh. you look at the employability and the number of companies comes and picks up the students, <coughs> banking, financial services okay. and insurance, okay. this is a major sector. So, banking also is even stock market experts are very much. Because they are also into yes. uh, the different yes, business. Yes, because uh, even if you look at today, uh, maybe a decade back bank was just dealing with your FDs and, lo uh, and they uh, give loans. But they if you they go they sell all the kind of financial products. True. You specifically a couple of times highlighted about mutual funds. Is it a part of stock market or is it a different ball game, sir? See, if you want to if you want to invest in equity, you can invest in two ways. Okay. Either you can invest directly stocks. Right. But <coughs> for that you know 
you should know have the knowledge or somebody will guide you stock brokers or whoever the so called advisor correct. will guide you correct mutual funds en ant helidre mutual fund is a indirect way of investing into the stock market, stock market okay which we suggest yakandre there are so many advantages in investing through mutual funds how that okay you can reduce the risk because the moment you invest in a mutual fund scheme en aagutade ant helidre automatically if you invest in a well diversified <coughs> equity mutual fund uh -huh. automatically you are investing diversifying your money into 40 50 stocks which is nothing but minimizing the risk okay do not keep all your eggs in one basket that is the first rule of investment absolutely so but the people who invest in few stocks few sectors mm -hmm. the there is a very high possibility of losing their money alwa okay so the first focus is that no risk to capital optimum return right so how is this mutual fund industry uh, in terms of employment sir is there options for the students that they can explore to capital market mutual fund is again a part of the capital market okay nimdu stock broking irbodu investment banking irbodu mm -hmm. banks irbodu mutual funds <coughs> irbodu registered uh, investment advisors irbodu all these are uh, very good uh, employers for students right so but the only challenge is that what they look into is what is your professional qualification absolutely ncfm nism or mandatory alwa take it as mandatory that is the only entry level nimge entry ticket iddage adu great so till now we spoke about the job opportunities so i have seen a good number of individuals today set up their own business and as you said uh, you spoke about uh, self employment opportunities also lies in this for example you can get into like uh, finest uh, franchises today uh, that's a part of the stock market agirbodu athwa mutual funds agirbodu so do you recommend uh, students to get into entrepreneurial mode in this area it's a very good question mm -hmm. uh, basically we at simple selling academy our uh, our vision is to create large number of uh, small entrepreneurs in the form of advisors fantastic i can tell you the first point is that i i am coming back to that point again the performance of sensex in the last 43 years mm -hmm. which is double than the inflation in the country <coughs> second point the total population investing in indian equity market right. is less than 2% absolutely the third data point is the total bank fd in india which is about 140 <laughs> lakh crores okay so this data disturbs me why ekandre we just look at the gross return what you are earning from it mm -hmm. so if we do a basic maths i'm telling you elementary maths now madidre what we need to look at is a one more concept called real rate of return anta adan check madbek now not just return what is real rate of return real rate of return is equal to gross return minus taxation minus inflation let's say bank fd is fully taxable so if today let's say now the bank fd interest rate is 6% per annum so if somebody is earning more than 10 lakh rupees per annum has to pay 30% tax bracket right income tax bracket Right. So if you go and keep money in a bank FD, mm -hmm. you are earning six percent. Mm -hmm. So what will be a tax uh, income tax you need to pay thirty percent on that. Right. So six percent minus one point eight percentage. Right. So what is your post tax return? Four point two percentage. Right. Ah, uh, four point two percentage in the inflation. Average inflation in the country is about as of now six uh, percent. Six percent. So four point two minus six percent. So what is your return? Minus one point eight. <laughs> so that means. your purchasing power is not increasing it is in uh, fact decreasing, decreasing by 1.8% so if your purchasing power is decreasing year on year mm -hmm. how do you increase your standard of life because you do not have money left in your pocket right and all your life you will work hard for money <laughs> and money is not working for you <laughs> this is the this is the biggest problem alwa i think you put in a very simple math uh, to tell like you know how so, this is important today atke helidu so what i tell what we tell people is that focus on very basic real rate of return mm -hmm. gross return minus taxation minus inflation this is a simple thing you need to understand true that's all idu yaro madabodu yava level navaru madabodu idannu i think some of the facts and figures what you shared today itself is a biggest motivation for the students to take up this uh, opportunity yes so nanu adu helta irudu so the bottom of the pyramid uh -huh. is completely into traditional investments either they are investing into contractual investments mm -hmm. or into guaranteed investments ee mm -hmm. eradu investment avenues alli mm -hmm. your real rate of return is either zero or negative imagine you are not uh, you are not into tax, uh, taxable income 
So, let us say now you are earning less than 2 and a half lakh rupees per year. So, 6 percent bank FD 6 percent, but 6 percent you are paying a indirect tax, co tax called inflation right. that nobody counts. True. So, in the cost of living has increased by 6 percent per annum and you earned again 6 percent from the bank FD which is gone 0. True. So, what I am trying to tell you is that it is not wrong that you have kept money in a bank FD. Mm -hmm. I, I give you 10 out of 10 because people who do not know swimming you should never jump into the water. <laughs> so, Adrinda, ye wrong advice and keli atwa bad advice and keli invest maadi hana kal kalu kinta, it is 1000 times <coughs> better to keep money in a bank FD Alwa. and safeguard your capital. Hmm. So, you are not taken risk to your capital, capital. excellent, I will give you 10 out of 10. Right. But my only concern is that the return what you are earning mm -hmm. will not take you anywhere. True. Ekanda, you are earning return equal to the inflation in the country. Absolutely. Adhan so, hello dila. Adhan hello dila. Even bank do not advise on these things when somebody comes to keep FD. Yes, within. because bank you know they are so busy they cannot give you individual uh, concentration. Plus uh, deposit is also like a bread and butter for them. Yes. The it's more and more deposit the more and more they can give in yes. terms of loans tomorrow. Yes. Alva. Great. So, Rivattu, you also made a statement in the opening remarks that uh, students should be trained beyond the academics, beyond just textbooks and theory. So, apart from let us say all these NCFM, NISM and uh, CFP, CFA, all these certifications, what skill sets you want today students to have in this domain sir? Yavriti yavru skill sets and improve matter. Yen requirement is there? Okay. Uh, see, now there are, I myself is an uh, entrepreneur okay. uh, for the last, uh, last 20 years. Right. Uh, you need to have a passion. That is more important. <coughs> well said. Because I always... Uh, uh, look at my goal. So, I will keep adjusting myself you know based on the goal because when the time passes you are going near to the goal and uh, you are also getting uh, aged. <coughs> mm -hmm. So, we need to achieve the financial freedom at the earliest in life. Then only you can live your dream life. dream They want to live a like life like that, this standard, all those things. Mm -hmm. But what is does not allow us to come out of it is that our financial obligations. So, suppose you have a home loan, so another 15, 20 years you are blocked. Mm -hmm. So, you are not able to get out of your employment that easily because there is a <coughs> monthly cost of living. Alva. So, the day you are secondary income or you create a income stream, regular income, if you create a regular income stream where you are not working Correct. and you earn a regular income, monthly regular income and your, if your cost of living is taken care, then you are financially free. Alva. So, that can be done in a various ways. So, one of the best way to create regular income is through through equity investments for long term. Okay. So, on an average let us say if somebody earn, save and invest for 20 years. So, then I can say that you can based on your uh, cost of living, if it is average cost of living then you can your uh, investments can generate that kind of return because we have got uh, so many clients True. who have achieved financial freedom at the age of 45. <coughs> Illi one more very important concept I want to highlight <coughs> because all are at a youngsters. Mm -hmm. Probably namma parents atawa namma grandparents ali avaru bere ondo formula follow marthi do investment sige. Iga currently what is the definition of investment? Income minus expenses is equal to savings. Right. That savings we are converting into investments. Right. What about if we don't have our increase uh, expenses has gone up and no savings? Mm. Today's youngsters say, okay, we will see next month. So, Idu, we are slowly getting that into next a… next month may never come. This is slowly we are getting into a follow, uh, following US uh, uh, trend, mm -hmm. where we started living on debt through oh, credit serious, cards. Absolutely. So, today's youngsters are may not be serious when they, they do not have savings. Mm. But if you look at our parents or grandparents, however small was their income, first they saved and take took out that money early in the first year savings on separate target then they the adjusted the expenses, expenses. Absolutely. so adrinda they do not require any kind of financial consultant <laughs> at their uh, their lifetime but today we need a no if you look at today the housewives or uh, without any degree with them they are considered to be the best financial planners in india Alva? yes they do not have any of this qualification in fact. It is simple. If you <laughs> want me to say that in a single sentence, it is 1000 times better to have a common sense than <laughs> education 
than having without common sense. <laughs> Very well said. So, other in the so lot of things uh, goes to the one is that you need to be a self discipline mm -hmm. and Very common important. sense, okay. patience. We cannot do things over a night. Exactly. And that is an absolute misconception today the people have on the stock market. So, this is the biggest now people have gone beyond stock market, right. they are talking about. Uh, cryptocurrencies, bitcoins, all kind of currencies. It is very sad because the kind of losses you know the it was 46 lakhs one bitcoin oh. now it is 16 lakhs imagine two third of the value gone. But that is not given a legal uh, status in India? Not yet. Alva. So, is it genuine to do it right now in India? I never recommend okay. because when there is a risk to capital mm -hmm. we never recommend and also we need to understand one very important point. Mm -hmm. We have various things, let us say we have stock market, we have real estate, we have uh, commodities, we have currencies. Mm -hmm. We have not understood one very important point, does all these markets give us opportunity to invest? No. Only few investment avenues like stock market will give a genuine uh, investment uh, opportunity, mm -hmm. real estate will give a genuine investment opportunity. Right. So, other in the and uh, and unfortunately people think that they are investing but they are speculating, speculating. the so called advisor or uh, somebody else will telling you that you are uh, investing but indirectly they are speculating and they are thinking they are investing <laughs> other than that they lose money second when there is a market does not give you opportunity let's say currency market you cannot get an opportunity to invest right commodity is no investment it is only as of now performance based only one the equity stock market to one do real estate to one do gold. Commodity one time are it alwa? Commodity see actually commodity when we are talking about commodity why the third party has an interest in a commodity. Right. What is the commodity is a agriculture who alwa. cultivate the crops and the end customer uses the thing. Right. Now, why the third party or a third person so in between? Right. They try to make profit by speculating it. Yes buy from a from a farmer uh, for a less price and then increase it and sell it though that keeps on happening true so in the now term the circus to kill the internet students may be quite uh, eager to know as well futures option with the derivatives are known to the concepts but it okay any things on the uh, that front and uh, see anywhere students there is nothing wrong in understanding the concept none of the hell do but again this will not give a option uh, opportunity for genuine investment okay Basically, derivatives, futures and option Allah came for a hedging purpose. Right. Hedging and then you risk and uh, loss and kadme mark koli goes karam. Right. But what happened? The the kind of volume that is happening in the futures and option is much higher than the okay. cash market or a spot market. Spot market. people started speculating in the futures and derivatives. Mm -hmm. So, by birth, humans are speculators. <laughs> which is in our blood which is perfectly fine okay. but we need to identify it present to it and do exactly opposite of it right. otherwise we lose our money right. so we don't recommend any of our people to get into oh, features and option mm -hmm. but nothing wrong in understanding the concept Concepts. so warren buffett or warren buffett is one of the legendary investor of the century right. he said uh, a very beautiful sentence which will completely close the features and option uh -huh. Derivatives, features, and options are financial weapons created for mass destruction. So one one sentence. In one sentence, he said He said that derivatives are like a hell, easy to get in, impossible to get out. <laughs> so with these two sentences, you can understand. So Adrinda, what we do is that we try to uh, make students avoid getting into these kind of speculative avenues absolutely again the once it becomes a habit then they will lose more so we wish and pray all these kind of speculators lose in the beginning so that their losses are minimum because if you are losing after so many years or so many months you are go, your bet will be very high so initially if you lose you yeah. you learn the lesson so very happy that uh, this program has also become like a platform wherein such information was shared so that they are they are very clear about it where to go where not to go yes alva so with the global level alli sikkapatte transformation gal aagta ide with especially with respect to the capital markets and other this trend is not uh, reflecting in our economy as well yes alva idakke 
government in the in other korate idea at we could investors at one of citizens cut in the other good where is the gaps here other even you know did any if you look at the investors uh, small investor data in the country mm -hmm. none in here so one is again coming back to guaranteed investments and contractual investments right guaranteed investments are all in the government epf here both the ppf here both the post office here both these are all guaranteed investments where re repayment of principal and interest is guaranteed by the government correct. of india correct so this is called guaranteed investments the next uh, major category is that contractual investment which is a contract between the lender and borrower with the best example is that bank bank fd where we give in the worst case the uh, maximum loss can be repaid by the bank is 5 lakh rupees you know that exactly so dicgc exactly so if you look at the data the majority of the small time small uh, investors investing in here mm -hmm. but the people who getting into entering into uh, performance based investments like stock market irbodu real estate irbodu uh, gold irbodu so has come down i can say their performance based investment they are volatile they volatile so the the people are not able to Predict. take that uh, volatility alwa so adrinda they want to be 100% safe, safe which is absolutely fine okay so what i say is that if you can know and understand few rules of performance based investments mm -hmm. you can become a successful investor and you can earn optimum return from the your investments Great. without taking any risk to capital i am let me repeat once again alwa no risk to capital and uh, 50% more than the bank fd interest rate fantastic ivattu sakashtu materialistic facts sakashtu vicharagalanna nee ivattu nam munde ittidiri and uh, somewhere uh, you also find that uh, there is a lot of gap that has to be filled what do you suggest the educational institutes sir in coming up many more deepak rao's in the coming days yes see uh, <laughs> again let me repeat that the mission of uh, simplest learning academy is to create large number of small entrepreneurs right so the gap is huge 2% of the <coughs> total population 130 so you're crores. also saying that there's a huge opportunity huge opportunity alwa how there's a crying is? need for you know quality investment advisors right so the the exam may cost you 2 and 1/2000 rupees yes. ncfm uh, 5a and tell you the model is okay so if you do that you are you can you can become a mutual fund distributor mm -hmm. and understand the basics mm -hmm. so then guide your investors in the right way alwa and they'll be with you for entire uh, their life wonderful idralli retention of clients is very very important most important Hello. because for that you have to do quality so if i come to you and you give me advice and you you promise me x amount of returns <laughs> and if i experience if i lost my capital uh, i will never, never come, come back, back to you <laughs> never come back to you great karyakramada kade hantake banide sir a lot of my students and parents have watched this what is the final message you want to give it to the students so the final message i always allow to see students as uh, entrepreneurs they becoming their own boss right because so you have to be more of job providers today than job seekers exactly so if you have that kind of passion give it a try nothing wrong in that mm -hmm. but if you do not have that kind of passion don't push yourself mm -hmm. nothing wrong in continuing in a employment okay because then i don't want want to you know students to build up that uh, mental yes. pressure right so if you have that passion for entrepreneurship self employment please uh, get into any kind of uh, self employment or a business mm -hmm. of your choice okay but if you are a, if you are a person uh, who is in more interested towards capital market stock market mm -hmm. money mm -hmm. so money was my passion i i always you know seen uh, money how it plays a major role in the in the human's life okay so that's my passion so i i am dealing with the money and investments so if you are serious please get into ncfm and nsm certifications right select your area Great. have a good mentor which is most important very good very because good. i must mention um, uh, my mentor gerard colaso from mangalore mm -hmm. so whatever i am today because of under his kind He's guidance for the well last uh, 20 years in this area yeah we have a, a lot of uh, students are uh, uh, intern uh, intern with him okay so a lot of uh, uh, students have taken up uh, entrepreneurship uh, like me with him right very nice great students i think uh, that was a wonderful discussion untara eye opener kuda helabodu yakandre sakashtu ivattu materialistic fact the ivattu nam resource person adanta deepak rao avaru nam munde place maadidare so one and two discussion alli we both are very sure that 
there is ample of opportunities for the students in the coming days. Our health is done. Hardly two percent of the market cover is there. So I think uh, this is the right time that uh, uh, you students take up interest in these courses so that uh, you can explore the ocean of opportunities that lies in front of you. I think we had a fantastic discussion in Margadarshi. In the hotne episode, in the halwaar episode, bear bear revision daily now barli ki deve. Keep watching this space. Niran Tarasuddhi matto mandaranjanega ki note taeri. Digi World, thank you for watching. Thank you.